Well, for more on Zaha Hadid's legacy, we're joined by Martha Thorne. She is the executive director of the Pritzker Architecture Prize. Thanks so much for joining us, Martha. The Pritzker Prize, as we said, is one of architecture's most prestigious awards. Tell us what made Zaha Hadid's work worthy of that recognition. Zaha Hadid was an incredible architect. Um, I think there are several things about her work. She was a pioneer when it came to parametric design, using the computer to generate design, test out different designs that she created. Um, the formal aspects of her architecture were always exuberant, experimental, and challenging. And I think also as a, as a pioneer, she was a woman who created incredible buildings, but also a very strong architectural studio. She had more than 150 people uh, at her, uh, on her team and has built all over the world. What kind of role model was she for, for other women in this profession? Zaha Hadid was an incredibly strong woman. I would say that perseverance, commitment, um, tirelessness, she was an incredible uh, person of energy, uh, was always working, always thinking about architecture. And on the other hand, she was a very loyal friend to her friends and colleagues. She was someone who had a deep uh, human spirit. So I think those two things together make her certainly a role model, not only for women, but for many, many people. Martha, do you have a favorite Hadi building or design? Oh, I, I think there are many. I, I think that in terms of a building uh, for a city, she did a beautiful museum in Cincinnati, Ohio, in the United States. I think that uh, in terms of uh, perhaps more uh, uh, exuberant buildings would be the aquatic center for the London Olympics or her opera house in Guangzhou in China. Perhaps the favorite of mine would be her, the fire station she did at the Vitra uh, campus in Switzerland. So what do you think will best characterize her legacy? I think her legacy will be in her buildings because they're really uh, outstanding. Each one is different, each one is uh, unique. And I also think that her legacy will be the role model that she represents for architects. Uh, that role model is someone who uh, does not shy away from experimentation, does not shy away from innovation. And no matter how strong her critics uh, and how many adversities that she faced, she was constantly fighting to move forward in the path that she sincerely believed in. And I think that, that that's a wonderful example for all of us. Okay, Martha Thorne, we will leave it there. Thank you so much for joining us.